MC was going on. It is Sunday, November 28th, 6.30 in the morning. I'm gonna be headed to Pierce College. Uh, Supercar Sunday is held there. It is sponsored by Porsche of Woodland Hills. My boy Steven is gonna be coming up there with me. Another fellow car enthusiast. I'm gonna take the Q50. It's held from 9 a.m. to 11, no, 7 to 10. So yeah, it's even earlier than the last meet that uh, I showed y'all when we went to Valencia. If you wanna get up, you wanna see exotic cars, you wanna see the nice car scene, you gotta get up early because the rich folks not bringing out their cars at 12 in the afternoon, dog. So if you wanna see the nice shit, nice cars, exotic cars, see some nice people and stuff like that, you gotta get up early. Um, it's 6.30 again, we're gonna head over here to Starbucks. He should be here in like five minutes. I'm gonna take the Q50. Uh, the meet is only about three hours, three, four hours. Um, we should get some roll up, roll through. We're gonna walk through, uh, get some quick reviews on some of the cars that we like, give y'all our personal preference. And um, yeah, man, stay tuned. Good day. All right, so my boy Steven said he was here, which is perfect. I was literally just about to fucking leave. So hold on, let me see what's man. Ooh, my boy got something nice. Yeah, mm -hmm. F Sport. We'll do a review on that in a minute. <sighs> what's up, brother? You ready to go? Yes, sir. <laughs> oh, you rolling now. All right, you know what's going on. Uh, follow me. All right. All right. <laughs> in the morning i got my boy with me though i got my boy with me so it should be a good day uh again the meet is only from 7 to 11. Oh, i just got a cold ass q50 pull up on the side look and he got his boy with him too look at that thing oh 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 i think i know where they're going it should be a good day though man y'all stay tuned one of the things I really like about this this event and uh, meets like this too, you know, it's kind of off topic, but it's like it brings you outside to see life, you know what I'm saying, at a different time. Like normal people, you know what I'm saying, y'all will be asleep right now, getting y'all beauty rest or whatever. But when you get out here and you see uh, the amount of people who are up just to see, uh, just to see, you know, uh, this event, it's, it's crazy. It's really crazy. Whew. Well, we here, we here early too. So you already know what we finna do. They switched the lot up on me. So we're at lot eight right now. Usually it's over there, but they have a vintage market little event that's going on. Or I guess they selling clothes and food and shit like that. But it is seven. We're here kind of early. Uh, we're gonna wait to see who rolls up, but um, People out here, they wiping down their cars. Um, yeah, it's a, it's a, yeah, it's, it's a I'm telling y'all, it's 7 a.m. So if you want to get around some, some a different crowd of people, you want to see some exotic cars, some different cars that you might not be able to see on the regular, you're gonna have to get up early. These people do not bring out their cars after, after a certain time. They trying to get out early while there's nobody out, show them off. We get that nice cruise in where there's no traffic and then they want to take that shit right back on home and park it they're not trying to be out here all day and run the risk of people following them home and doing all that goofy shit but that's just a little tip i don't know if this shit went through we're gonna find out <laughs> We just put our coffee bin so we can go back up here and see these cars. If he would have declined, he would have said something fast. Yeah, something. Because if he took this damn long to tell me that I ain't got no money on my cord. Oh, yeah, there we go. First. Mm -hmm. There you go, brother. Thank you, my brother. Thank you, man. Thank you. All right, we are back. Oh. Yeah, 
Big Brother Man like that right there. Ooh. That's one of his joints. Ooh, they got the little wires on the back. Yeah, that's one of his joints okay, right there. He actually got my brother over there, got some hot chocolate. He don't fuck with the coffee. <laughs> but it's all good, you feel me? We finna go back up here. Uh, we seen a lot of roll, roll by, so I think people are on their way there. It's been about 20 minutes. Hopefully it's changed. Just a little bit. Because somebody come around that corner. Yeah. Look at the door. Ooh. He started from the top. Bro. That was amazing. <laughs> I don't know what that shit is, but hey, we here at Supercar Sunday. It's a beautiful event. I'm sipping on this coffee. I'm gonna go over here and get you guys some more footage. Stay tuned. This car after watching Will Smith in Bad Boys 2. Look at the carbon fiber on that wheel. Correct me if I'm wrong, but this is the same chassis that they used at Chevy to build the new C8 platform as well as the a Porsche. I think this is a 488. You gotta know to know this car. Not the SBJ. Come on. These are hard to find right now. I wanna say this car is going for like damn near a million. Go came with the doors open. Cars are going for at least eight hundred thousand dollars. Beautiful. Porsche GT three. I didn't even know that these cars come with a four 
four, four, four liter, six. McLaren. This isn't the 720S model, but this is still a beautiful car. I think to get in, you have to use, it's on the inside of there. And there's a little handle. the Miatas I've seen. This has to be the coldest. Wide body. They usually people with LS swap them, but this car is badass. Pontiac GTO. This car was in triple, was it triple X, bro? With ice cubes, yeah. That purple one, no, shooting shooting rockets out the at the out the headlight. Yeah, that was this car, y'all. I think this is a '69 Pontiac GTO. Beautiful classic. Come on, Chevy Nova. Built, built nice, built clean, built with respect. Look at him. C2 Corvette convertible. Gotta be one of the coldest Corvettes for sure. For sure. And he LS3 swapped it. Come on. He knew what he was doing. He knew what he was doing. beautiful car beautiful black paint I want to say that's the original interior I like this I like this I preferably I like the hard top with the back the hard back end but that's a nice car come on gotta show some love to the Huracan I like that SDJ because it's a little bit bigger you know, I'm a taller guy. I'm like six, six one, six two. But this car is fucking fire. I want to say it comes with a V10. So we went and got coffee, and I can say uh, I think it was worth coming back because now it is popping out here. What you think? It was worth coming back. Good work coming back. My boys say good work coming back, guys. Look at this. Look at this thing right here. Every time I see this car, I fall in love with it even more. I swear to God. 460 horsepower, dual clutch transmission, seven speed. I thought this was the 10 speed. It's actually a seven. That's the biggest hood scoop done by Ford. The last one was on the Mach 1, but that was a functional hood shaker. This one is a this the hood scoop. That shit is cute as fuck. Look at the wheels. Look at that thickness. I like the trimming six speed, but a seven speed dual with a dual clutch transmission. This car is eating. Eating shit up. It's like the perfect blend. Like for me, the Challenger is too big. The Camaro is too small, but then this one is like perfect in between. Bam. Clarence. I want to 
gonna say this is an older model. This is still clean. Mm -hmm. I'll take this car in a heartbeat, y'all. And it's shined by Carol Shelby in the inside. Beautiful car. Thickness. Got his twin. Over the Mustang, next to the Challenger, this is the car I would get. Chevy Z06, supercharged, C7, convertible. I would get the convertible, not gonna lie. Like, look at that, peanut butter goods. I didn't know it was a GT500. This thing is beautiful. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. And take going into the fender wall. Paxton Novi Supercharger. We're about to go over here and check out these Ferraris. I don't know the models of these cars, but they're all beautiful. This one specifically is a newer model. Oh my God. Look at the point in that front end. Oh my god. This is a beautiful car. <laughs> Those lights kind of look like the Camaro tail lights. Tell me I'm lying. But I could bring it to you. That a beautiful white one right next to it. So I found out what this one is. It's an SF90. That's a Ferrari SF90. I've never seen that car. I know that's a brand new vehicle. If you know what that is, if you know how much that is, type that down below. Because uh, I know that's some exclusive shit. Did you see that? Did you see that? That was, that was, that was nice. There was a lot of nice people over there. Different crowd. Different crowd. Again. Another beautiful Ferrari. So I thought that the water would get caught right there when it rains, but you can see the floor right there coming out the bottom. Well, I left the windows open so we can see the inside. I appreciate it. It's 
a 488 Pista, if I said that right. Mm. Look at this car. I want to say Ferrari is definitely king of the mid-engine vehicle. That's probably where Corvette got it from, if I'm not tripping. But that's a beautiful, beautiful car. Yellow one behind it. Porsche on the side. Again, this is sponsored by Porsche Woodland Hills. This is Supercar Sunday as hell. If not every Sunday, every other Sunday from seven to 10. Look at this beautiful Cobra. from 7 to 10 beautiful GT3 it's held at Pierce College today it's in lot 8 it's usually held in the front this is like I think where student parking is but it's a nice turnout we got here earlier it was it was hardly any cars and now it's it's packed with beautiful beautiful vehicles so this car right here I want to say is what started the the hood scoops for the Mustang. This beautiful, beautiful 69. Beautiful car. I was gonna say this model also comes in a Boss 302 option. We have the regular. Mustang. Hold on, this is my brother Cup of Tea. Go on and talk to him, Steven. Let him let him know what this let him know. Let him know what this is. Uh-huh. Alright, Grand Coupe. Twin turbo. V6 and or inline six. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Inline six, inline six. You heard on inline six. Look at the color, man. Calipers to match the paint. This is a beautiful car. You can't see the inside because bro got this thing tinted out. But you, hey, man, this is you, brother. This, this is you. I think this, I think this is, this is what you need right here. What y'all think, bro? Bro got the black and white on already. I think this is what he need right here. 440, y'all. I like this thing, man. Beamer 440, gonna follow that, man. Hot rod. Okay. Definitely don't see this every day. Look at that. Oh my God. That interior looks better than some of y'all's current vehicles. No offense. That's a classic, man. That's a classic. Look at the back. Beautiful car. I want to say this is a Ford something. Another beautiful hot rod. Beautiful cars, man. Look at that inside again. That is cool. Look at the booty. He was inside. He wasn't trying to come outside, but that was Kevin Hart. That was Kevin Hart? Yeah. You see the man? Everybody like that's Kevin Hart. Uh, yeah. He must have been inside. Yeah, we went over there. He wasn't he wasn't in there. So we was literally sitting outside. What? We were sitting outside that car for like 10 minutes? 15 minutes? Yes. <laughs> Bro must have been inside because you know it's Kevin Hart. He got money. He's up here. Yeah, he, he brought three Ferraris. So I'm guessing he was inside this building that the cars were parked outside of. Because when we went over there, it was only Asian people. Keep it real. But 
that was Kevin Hart in that brand new Ferrari, y'all. Kevin Hart. Supercar Sunday, Pierce College. Look at this. That is a beautiful car. Man, I'm still shocked that that was Kevin Hart. He was literally just like right, right here. No cap, he was right here. And that goes back to what I was telling y'all earlier. If y'all wanna see stuff outside the box, you know, outside of your norm, you gotta step outside the box. And normally people don't get up this early to come look at no cars. But Kevin Hart was up here at seven in the morning. Last weekend, Kaylin Jenner was up here. And I wanna say next weekend, is the motor for toys, so we gonna cover that too. And just imagine who we gonna see on that day. But yeah, man, it's a good day so far. I got my boy with me, you know what I'm saying? And uh, yeah, we about to keep on seeing what we see. What's up, bro? What's going on, man? That's low six, y'all. Everybody coming in for Paul Walker, y'all see it? Bro said he had got some free stuff for us, dude. I don't know what, bro, he said for Veterans Day. Check my man's out right here. We don't want that shit. No. Tell us, Steven, we do not want that. Mm. Man, I told y'all, I'm a Mustang man, bro. This car right here. What y'all think, man? I, I ain't gonna lie, I've been looking. Man, look at that. Brand new dash. Man, and it's the, and it, he got the six. He got a six speed. Normally people like this car with the 10 speed transmission because if I'm not mistaken, 10 speed stock motor, cold air intake, E85 with a tune. This car is putting out like at least five, like buy something to the wheel. Smell that Steven? Yes, sir. Somebody over here smoking on some gas. I didn't know that. Look, I didn't know we could do that. I didn't look, I didn't want to be that guy. But look, don't tip me. Look at that thing, man. You got the halo rings around the lights, beautiful blue paint with a black striping. I like this. Just imagine this paint after a wash, 5.30 at night, right before the sun drops. This shit would look so good. Beautiful car. S197. You definitely follow him already. Yeah. Damn, that shit smell good. It smell good in there. This motherfucker is fire, y'all. Toyo proxies. That motherfucker is so wide. 325. 325. This is the owner of Cali Creamins car. He must be able to. His brother is a five zero low. Y'all can follow him on Instagram. One low six. Beautiful build, carbon fiber on the wheels. Wide body kit, Toyo proxy wheels. I want to say it's a supercharged V six. Beautiful car, man. Nine eighteen Spider. Y'all, let me show you the inside. Look at those seats. It's a hybrid. It's a beautiful hybrid. Yeah. And y'all, it's a beautiful day, man. I'm out here at uh, Supercar Sunday, Pierce College. It's a great turnout. I'm seeing a lot of familiar faces, including Kevin Hart. That shit is mind blowing. Uh, leave a comment down below if you made it this far. Appreciate the love. Comment down below. Like, subscribe, hit that bell notification. Again, I'm gonna have some great content coming to this channel. Got another beautiful 66. I believe it's a 66 Cobra. Beautiful ass car. Beautiful. I love the side pipe. It's a Roush. 
This thing is you just gorgeous. Red line tires. Gorgeous. Beautiful car. Okay, bro didn't come to play. I brought his car on the trailer. I don't really know his setup, but it's a Camaro. Her short short throw her short throw shifter. Mm. Mm. The tires, beautiful build, beautiful build. Look at these GTRs. If I was to get a JDM vehicle, it would be this right here. Beautiful. GT4. Beautiful car. Beautiful car. Porsche GT4. that we just saw Kevin Hart in. He brought two of them and a, I don't know that other Ferrari it was, but he brought three Ferraris up here. And he brought a newer version of this model, if I'm not mistaken. I thought it was this model, but the taillights were definitely different. Ooh, this car is fucking amazing. Beautiful Ferrari, dude. got to be one of the best SUVs out right now for sure for sure has to be the car is ridiculous ridiculous you gotta look is this your car this your uncle's this is nice bro your drive to work today was fun. I bet you enjoyed your drive. <laughs> oh, this is badass. 760 horsepower, right? Uh, a thousand. A th you had a thousand already? E85, he tuned it. They, they uh, did something with the supercharger. Oh, wow. That's why he put all that meat back there. Yeah, that's why. I was wondering. I was like, that's a lot. Well, you heard E85. They must have swapped the pulley out. He's at a thousand horsepower. Ugh, look at the thickness. I knew something was going on. Here you go. You know, his drive to work was amazing. Thousand horsepower E85 build. That was a GT500. Thousand horsepower E85 build. They must have swapped out the pulley. Uh, you saw the tires in the back. I don't know what else you could do to that car. Dual clutch transmission. I know that car is flying. Um, that was a security guard. He said his uncle let him bring that car to work. So I know he for sure enjoyed his uh, enjoyed his drive. Older model, Aventador, Lamborghini with the red seats. Just get a get get get, get in on that. Come on now. Calipers to match the seats. This is another vehicle that shines with that mid-engine. So I don't know what this thing is, but it says it's a Bugatti. Whole Bugatti. Whatever this car is. Beautiful car. Beautiful car. We got some more McLarens that came in and now we got some more BMWs for my brother to look at as he's getting excited over there you can see him he's getting excited um yeah man, this is a good this is a good day good event it's getting 9 30 so people are starting to leave but 
some some more cars are still showing up. Four competition. Talk to them, people's champ. What, what is that right there? Four competition. Oh my god. Look at the lights, guys. You know, the, the big girl has, they has the wrong, but I do like it a lot. Oh, it has the white and it's fine. Oh, my God. Import competition, guys. These seats are ridiculous. Ridiculous. I want to say these are some of the best seats you can get right now on the market, hands down. Carbon fiber, backside. I'm absolutely impressed with this M4 competition. 2020, I believe. GT3 RS. Right next to a beautiful, no, Huracan, excuse me. McLaren 720S. Come on. Now this is the model I was saying that was 710 horsepower. And what I love about this vehicle is it has suspension in the front to where it knows when the car is coming up on a curb and it'll automatically lift. Or you can press the button and it lifts the suspension to where you won't damage the front of the vehicle. The body lines and the curves is unmatched. Like, a, a, you know a McLaren when you see a McLaren. And then right here, I believe is the, it's not a 720, but it's definitely his brother. Just entering these cars is, is ridiculous. So this is a 600 LT. No, you're good. You're good. 600 LT. Beautiful car, guys. Beautiful. Look at how thin those seats are. They remember when the white engine for the SLR, the Mercedes? They're making the engines for the SLR? Yeah. No, SLR is McLaren. So everybody's getting ready to leave now. I was just told that McLaren made the S well helped build the SLR for Mercedes. So that was something new. Um, as you can see, we was uh, talking there today. Got some good content. Talked to some of the people. Kevin Hart was here. Next weekend is gonna be a great, great event. We are gonna make sure that we come back for that. My boy, he's excited. He saw his Beamers. He happy. Beamer um, gang. Yeah, man. We saw like at least what six McLarens? Yes. Like six McLarens. Uh, oh, the badass one. He's still over there. Um, and yeah, people, they, they, they're getting ready to leave, y'all, as y'all can hear it. Um, we're going to try to get some of these roll rollouts, get out here so you can see some of these people taking off, peeling out, burning a little rubber, you know, California living.
see Malik's car entertainment. That concludes today's video. I hope y'all enjoyed today's content. Um, we're gonna be back next Sunday because for sure it's gonna be popping. We saw Kevin Hart today. I seen one low six. Uh, I seen a couple other familiar faces, but y'all don't know them, so you know what I'm saying. But it was a great turnout. We seen some great cars. Me and my boy, we about to leave. Go get some grub, go get some food, get some drink. Do what we do, man. Enjoy the rest of this beautiful Sunday. And if you made it this far, like, subscribe, comment down below. Stay tuned for the next video.